Hello everyone, it's my pleasure to kick off the first session today. I'll be sharing our vision for Huawei Mobile Services and our plans to support the developer community by innovating and growing together. My name is Aoife Brodigan and I lead marketing for Spiegel and Huawei Mobile Services in Europe. 2020 has been a year of opportunity and change. From a developer perspective, there's a lot to think about when building new apps. Like what platforms and devices will you support? How will you handle the rise of foldable phones and wearable devices? What are the best ways to make better use of 5G, AI, or cloud technology to create faster, richer, and more engaging experiences? Or maybe you're thinking about evolving your monetization strategy to test more in-app advertising or subscription models. According to Statista, mobile app revenue is expected to reach a staggering 935 billion by 2023. It's definitely an exciting time to be a developer. Whatever your strategy might be, our goal is to be right here with you, facing these innovation challenges and opportunities together. We are all living in a digitally connected world where people expect more from the brands, businesses, and apps they interact with. Our vision for Huawei Mobile Services is to work together with our partners to give people a fully connected digital lifestyle that is safe, secure, and seamless. And we've already begun this journey by reimagining some of the core services that people use. Take Maps, for example. Earlier this year, we partnered with TomTom to give developers access to their maps, traffic information, and navigation capabilities, so you can leverage the full power of location possibilities to create better experiences for consumers. And when it comes to AI, we didn't just focus on building a voice assistant, we've built a suite of intelligent capabilities to predict what content people might be interested in seeing. This means that when you open up your first screen on your phone, you'll see a tailored AI experience with news stories from your favorite sites, sports results from your favorite team, or travel updates and reminders to add items to your shopping list. The possibilities are endless. We've also been exploring ways to use technology like AR and VR. In China, we've launched our AR map and navigation experience to help guide people through cities and create some really immersive experiences in our flagship stores. In the future, we hope to bring some of these experiences to Europe too. Through all of this innovation and change, we remain committed to three core principles. Our number one priority is to protect customer data by following the strictest privacy guidelines. All of our customer data in Europe is stored on servers in Europe, and we use Chipset device cloud protection to ensure the customer data is encrypted when it's uploaded to the cloud. We also have rigorous testing procedures to ensure the apps on App Gallery don't pose a security risk to customers. If, as a developer, you fail one of these security checks, don't worry, we'll give you clear feedback so you can address any problems before your app is uploaded. Our focus for App Gallery is quality, not quantity. For developers, this means less competition from low quality apps that undermine people's trust in the store. Our final principle is to focus on creating seamless experiences with cross-device compatibility as standard. Let's take music, for example. With Huawei ID, you can listen to songs on Huawei Music from any Huawei device, so you can pick up where you left off listening to an album on your phone, on your TV, on your watch, even your car. All of these seamless experiences are made possible because Huawei has one complete ecosystem. We can combine all of the software capabilities of HMS with the hardware capabilities from our devices like phones, laptops, and watches. What this means for you as a developer uh, for App Gallery is that all of the features with HMS Core are specifically designed to work with Huawei devices so you create the best possible user experience. Alongside these strong device sales, we've also seen the number of global mobile active users rise to 700 million, while App Gallery has an impressive 460 million monthly active users. The growth in Europe is going well too, with 72 million active users, up 62% on last year. As we continue to grow new services like music, video, assistant, and browser, 
we are creating more opportunities to partner with the business communities and more ways for developers to engage customers through our ads platform. All of this growth would not have been possible without the support of the developer and business community. We've partnered with lots of big names in music, entertainment, news and travel industry to bring exciting new content to our customers. We've also welcomed some big names to the app gallery in Europe, including Booking.com, Viper, Deezer, and many others. And we're working hard every day to ensure we support developers of all sizes to bring new apps on board. As we continue to build our capabilities to support the local community in Europe, we've transferred all of our operations to our Irish subsidiary, Aspiegel, which is headquartered in Dublin, Ireland. A Spiegel is now the service provider for Huawei mobile services in over 60 countries. And we're excited to expand our teams by, in Europe by bringing more experts in engineering, development, marketing, and operations so that we continue to support the needs of developers and consumers. And we're pleased to see that the developer community is growing too. A big welcome to all of the new developers in Europe that joined us this year. Our registrations are up 500% on last year, while the number of apps integrating with HMS core features is up 1900%. We're also really proud to announce that the total revenue paid out to developers in Europe increased by an incredible 425% over last year. With the launch of HMS Core 5.0, we'll be introducing new capabilities for developers to build innovative apps, such as Computer Graphics Kit, AR Engine, Accelerate Kit, and more. HMS Connect, along with App Gallery Connect and Ability Gallery, will also provide more business solutions to support user acquisition and monetization of your apps. And you'll hear more about these features in the next session. Earlier this year, we were really excited to launch the Find Apps widget in Petal Search. In a crowded app market, finding the right app can be difficult. We believe Petal Search will offer a new gateway for people to search and discover the apps they really want to download. In cooperation with Quant and more vertical partners, we'll be looking to redefine the way people search on Huawei devices. And finally, to our other big news this year, with the launch of the Huawei Ads platform. Since the platform opened, we've seen incredible growth with lots of developers and partners seeing success in reaching Huawei users. Be sure to check out the Ads platform session later today to hear how you can get started and how you can engage over 700 million monthly active users. And now to a special message from our VP of Huawei Mobile Services, Jervis Sue who will share some interesting news on a new initiative to support the developer community. Hey everyone, so I hope you are uh, enjoying the FTC conference this year. It's amazing to see why mobile service has grown. We have over 700 million users now and 1.6 million developers globally. 2020 was a big year. We have launched music video and pet search and more service in Europe. A big thank to you all of our partners that, that bring those quality content and service to the market. Today, I will uh, really excited to announce that we will open up a digital lab in Dublin and Dusseldorf. So the lab developers from uh, over 60 countries can visit our lab and use our advanced cloud testing and debugging service online. In DG Lab, we have set a 5G all scenario environment where you can test and run your apps across 250 of our devices. Our team also here to help you on how to integrate your apps with the latest HMS core new features. If you are looking for quiet space to work, we have some hot desk where you can code in peace and uh, meeting areas 
you can brainstorm ideas with your team and let and uh, other developers. But the area of fully connected world has arrived. I'm excited to see all that we can achieve together based on the Huawei platform. Thank you. We hope to welcome you to the DigiX Lab in Dublin and Dusseldorf very soon. In addition to this great resource, we've also got the Shining Star program, where we have one billion incentives to support the developer community. And in June this year, we introduced our Apps Up competition with a global prize fund of $1 million. There are lots of prizes to categories to enter, including best app, best game, best social impact, and more. If you have an app that's integrated with HMS Core, be sure to submit your app by the 8th of October. You'll be in with a chance to win some amazing prizes, along with the chance to be featured on App Gallery. To find out more about this competition, along with more developer resources, check out the Huawei Developer website. You can also join our developer community where you can pose new questions to our experts. We'll have lots more exciting events and webinars coming later in this year. Stay tuned. It's been an incredible year for Huawei Mobile Services, and we're really looking forward to what the future might bring. When I think about the road ahead, I'm reminded of an African proverb. If you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. We really value your partnership and hope you will join us in building a digitally connected future that is full of innovative apps and seamless experiences. Thank you.